Welcome, Earth Tribe, to your monthly Earth Tribe report for the Zodiac signs, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. You are welcome to watch this if your moon and rising are here as well as your sun. This will be accurate for you. For the whole tribe, similar to the fire signs, we got the Ten of Wands. Both you and the fire tribe are stepping into great success. It's just this success comes with burden and responsibility. The Ten of Wands is a success you get when you open a new business and you're booked out with clients, but you don't really have a manager. You don't really have an assistant. You have to do like 50 jobs at once and actually deal with the burden of the success of your own responsibility. I don't think I said that right, but you get what I mean. As long as you don't procrastinate, you'll be good. Taurus, we do have the Magician card, and this is really interesting because we have the Knight of Swords that is carrying the Enlightenment of the Ace of Swords. This is urging you to leap forward for a truth that you know is right. It will trigger people mercilessly, but you know is true. You have the talents and the skills and resources you need to manifest what you want and desire. And it's very important that you note that this Knight of Swords is really a message of truth. There's clarity and an epiphany near the end of the season you'll gain that I think is going to come to you from a Gemini or from this Knight. If this doesn't represent you, it represents someone giving you the truth, whether it's a hard pill to swallow or something you've always accepted. Taurus, this is a very magical month for you. And the more you take action to really manifest the thoughts you're thinking with proper strategy, the best, uh, the better rather. Virgo, we do have the tower card and the page of cups as well as the eight of cups so that tower card could be disconcerting some of you could realize you're unexpectedly pregnant with a child um that's not always fun but this is more so speaking of maybe an instant new romantic attraction that tower card is an unexpected influence that hits as soon as sagittarius season starts i don't think that this will be bad for most of you just a little bit troubling Thankfully, with the Page of Cups after, it does seem to be something that inspires you with deeper emotions. It's just with that Eight of Cups, you're going to find that it's not enough and you seek deeper meaning in whatever this has opened up for you. You might find yourself walking away from friendships, relationships, uh, job arrangements. It's all good. Just to make sure you have the heart to stay distant because you're walking away from what no longer serves you. Capricorn. Holla at your boy. Look at that. Look at that. That looks amazing. You're definitely starting the, the month off or the season off hands on. You're definitely a hustler. You're working hard and staying productive. And this is going to lead into more success that might have your hands full, but will totally pay off with the Ten of Cups. Ending the season off with such a peak experience, great love and just amazing spiritual bliss that you worked hard for because you just love working and working and just traveling and working. So yes, Capricorn, congratulations. And that's all I got for the Earth fam. Show me some love in the comments. And until next season, peace out.